Adam Pinchewski, Executive Director of Green Cross International in Geneva. One great example is in the area of irrigation, and we have been powering some of the irrigation in Senegal with diesel generators because that has been the tradition and we have transitioned to solar panels and that has helped us reduce costs dramatically and make food production much more competitive. Some of the greatest obstacles still have to do with fossil fuel subsidies. Fossil fuels are subsidized to, at a rate of 10 to 1 in many countries versus renewable energy and that has been a terrible problem and despite this, this differential renewables are increasingly competitive in an increasing number of cases. Well, the economics are very compelling, but the energy security aspect and being able to generate energy on the spot, oftentimes when it's needed, is an absolute uh, great advantage of, of solar panels, for example. Well, being able to generate energy where it's needed on the spot, for example, at a border control that is a remote location, far away from any uh, power plant, the cheapest way to, to arrive at local energy is through solar panels. Well, in Senegal, for example, we took over a, a large area of land, over 60 hectares of land that was abandoned and that local authorities said would never be useful for, for anything. We took over this land and we have been able to generate organic agriculture for and providing employment for over a thousand people, irrigating the crops, not with diesel powered generators but using solar panels and that has helped reduce the cost of, of this food uh, tremendously, provided employment to mostly women and, uh, and essentially helping resolve a food security problem in the area. 